Stroller. So this is part two of our Magic Kingdom day. We were there all day and then we went to the pool to have some fun, right? Yeah. And then I lost my Magic Band. Good time. Anyways, if you haven't seen part one, I will link it up here and down below. So be sure to check that out. And it's currently about 4.30 p.m. and we are heading back Magic Kingdom. So we'll see you there. So dark. It says, Welcome to Magic Kingdom. Oh, look at the monorail. So, <laughs> so amazing. So relaxing. So Disney. So, like I said, it's about five o'clock. We're coming back, and the park closes at nine. So, we're gonna close out the park. We hope to do mine train. Carousel Progress, Buzz, Haunted Mansion, Small World, Peter Pan, maybe Jungle Cruise. Haven't been on that in a while. We feel like we've done, I'm just gonna say, it feels like we've done a lot of rides that like we normally do, but when you think about it, we kind of haven't. I think we were much more successful this trip like, than yeah, yeah. Definitely. Then last trip. Because last trip was like a disaster. Last trip we only got like three or four rides. Well, we got a few rides in because it rained. And that was the only thing that saved us. Yeah. Alright. We got some pictures done by the big Christmas tree. And use the restrooms. And now. We're going down Main Street, USA. So happy to be here. It looks a little bit busy. Aiden was complaining that it's busy. So, let's see. There is a tree moving. Oh, it's, it's a cavalcade. So All right, we made a little pit stop. We're waiting for can't see, but it says spring rolls. They usually have the cheeseburger or the steak spring roll and then a pepperoni spring roll. So I'm excited. I want to get it. The line is like hella long. We've been here probably for like 10 minutes already, but we have like one, two, three, four, four, four people ahead of us. And after this, we're heading to my train. We're next. So this cart is right before Adventureland. Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> so I already started because these are so good. So this is a cheeseburger and this is the pepperoni. Let me see if I can. Oh, I can't even break it. It's so greasy. Look how greasy it is. Ah, 
but these are delicious and you can get them right before like Crystal Palace is right there and this is the cart so right before you enter adventure so mixed feelings um, the cheeseburger spring rolls were amazing like really tasty really juicy really really good felt like I was eating a cheeseburger however the pepperoni ones were absolutely gross like bleh, disgusting and I have never said anything like that about any Disney food but it was Disgusting. It was disgusting because all you tasted was pepperoni. Like there was no cheese, there was no nothing else. Super greasy and just super, super gross. Like I literally took one bite and then I broke the other one just to see if it was like the same consistency. It was the same thing. Do not remember them being like this the other few times that I have tried them. It's just gross. So, seven dollars down the drain. All right, we're off to mine train. Super busy. Can I make the best of it? You know how this holiday 2020 treat tastes. All right, the milkshake was super sweet. The churro was super dry. Thumbs down. Definitely a thumbs down. Would not recommend it. But it looked pretty. It had potential. But just wasn't wasn't there. Andrew over here but just wasn't there. All right, now it's time for Great Big Beautiful and Tomorrow. In that reservoir, keep five gallons of water hot and just three buckets of coal. Oh, oh, that sure beats chopping wood. And isn't our new ice box a beauty? Look at that, holds 50 pounds of ice. Milk doesn't sour as quick as it used to. And our dog Rover here keeps the water in the drip pan from overflowing. Kerosene, no more gas. <laughs> Sarah sure gets to the core of the apple. But we do have this new wash day marvel. And now it takes me only five hours to do the wash. Imagine, it used to take two days. Well, that's right, folks. Now Sarah has time for other things like... like and Carousel of Progress was absolutely awesome. Amazing. There's a great, big, beautiful tomorrow. And we don't have a voice to sing. <laughs> uh, all right, we are off to Buzz Lightyear. It says it's 15 minutes, so we're gonna do it. See you there. Not too bad for our mom. Not too bad. And baby Andrew, 1200. He loves to spin this thing around. Okay, you're gonna make me sick. Ah, boss was good. I think I, I think I won. <laughs> yeah. I think I won. All right, let's get our stroller. 
and we're gonna be going to Speedway because it's only five minutes. Andrew! So we're gonna do that. We're still on, we're still good on time. It's 6.43, park closes at nine. So, fingers crossed, we get to do a handful of rides. <laughs> It's hard to see, but look at the castle and the projections on it. We haven't seen it yet. This roller coaster is intense. We've been on Dumbo, so we figured we'll do it today. Cover your face, honey. You know what I really forgot about Dumbo? What? Like, two Dumbos. One is the standby and one is the fast time. Yeah. But of course, probably both of them are running. I guess we go here. Come on, Ann. Oh, everything's closed here. Left or right? Left or right, left or right, 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 right. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my gosh, <laughs> the first time ever on the Bart Stormer. Andrew, be here, baby. Here we go. There's a new ride that Aiden loves. Yeah, this is a uh, Bart Stormer. Second time. No butterflies at all. It's better than like, any Like not like bumpy, bumpy, bumpy. Yeah, not bad. I'm probably not gonna put my hands up Haunted Mansion. It's 10 minutes. So we're gonna do this. We have, I think, just about maybe like one hour and 10 minutes left before the park is closed. Now we have to leave. So we made our way to the front of 
the beautiful castle. It looks gorgeous. I don't think we're gonna see all of them because we are beat and we're literally on our way out. But I just wanted to stop here and take in this beautiful view before we go. So pretty, right, Aiden? I can just stand here and watch it forever, but we're so tired. Hello, friends. <laughs> This light is insane. We are back in our hotel. There's the boys eating in bed. It's Disney, it's vacation. They're just, they're living their best life, right? Yeah. Okay, finish your food, boys. Anyways, so um, I ordered something to eat. So. One of the quick serve, well, the quick service restaurant that's here, I keep forgetting what it's called. I'll put it over here. All they have is like, um, like burgers, burgers, chicken sandwiches, sandwich, sandwich, sandwich. And I've just like, I'm missing my greens and my salads and stuff like that. So I had this menu that they left. I want to say like I don't remember it being before, but I'm sure they offered indoor dining and uh, indoor dining, in-room dining before. But anyways, so I ended up getting a Caesar salad, fourteen dollars, <laughs> and she did ask if I wanted chicken or shrimp on top. I was like, no, it's fine, I do. And I got buttermilk fried chicken, uh, hand-breaded chicken breast with loaded smashed potatoes and warm bacon vinaigrette for 27 bucks. Let me take it out and show you what it looks like. Hopefully it's good. I want a nice, healthy, <laughs> healthy fried chicken meal. Okay, so I guess this is, I guess, this is the chicken with the potatoes and bacon. Here's my... Caesar salad, nothing fancy, just my salad. Guess this is the dressing. Got a little ketchup, salt and pepper, plate, and some rolls with butter. I wonder if they're warm. Yes, they are warm. Yum, 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 yum. Okay guys, I'm gonna enjoy. So, yep. This cost me $56. Hello. It is very late, probably. I mean, not very late, but quite late. Um, my dinner was good. Um, there was so much chicken, like for stay here and you order that. That's enough for like two people. There was huge two pieces of chicken, a lot. So anyways, in bed, try to wash my face a little bit. I could see that I'm burned. It is what it is. Tomorrow we have Animal Kingdom. Um, I am still debating, trying to figure out how we're gonna do it. Um, do I want to wake up early in the morning? <laughs> no but have more or less of an empty park and do whatever we need to do or do we just like roll up in the afternoon and have a packed park and deal with the crazies <sighs> i don't know probably we're gonna end up waking up early thank you so much for watching if you have any questions please leave them down in the comments below don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and be sure to hit the bell so you'll be notified when we upload a new video because we still have two days here and we have Animal Kingdom and we have like a whole pool day. So yeah, be sure to come back to watch more. We'll see you real soon. Bye.